Okay, guys, welcome back to another episode of Argentina. That's what I would have said, people, if we were still Argentina. But we are La Plata. La Plata. Yeah. Uh, somebody in the comment section, please tell me what actually La Plata means. Because uh, in my mind, I just associate La Plata with the plate. And somebody who's from Argentina could probably tell me that's wrong. But yeah, please tell me I'm wrong. Because it sounds like a stupid name. It's like... Your name is the plate. Our national, our national flag is like. <laughs> wow, I, I was thinking like a national flag is like the silver silverware that you get from like, from like um your grandma's house when they segregation. They must be integrated if necessary. I'm pretty sure that's where our country's moving to. And anyways, guys, yeah. Besides for that really weird thought I was thinking, let's get back into the game where I'm building up stuff. Uh, basically seeing, I'm getting a lot of, okay, the printing press in Rio de Aries has to collapse because that's, we'll give it a couple days. We're, right now, okay, there we go. Everything's collapsing. Wow, we just lost everything. Okay, so, Burl Rails, uh, this might, okay, I have to figure out, okay, I have to figure out these regions and figure out where they built, where the capitalists built these things. So, let's see. Region-wise, this is Belo Par uh, Paraguay, so let's see. Oh, that's a terrible place. If it was right here in the Il Grey, I would have said we could build, we could build this iron, this bronze artillery factory. But that's a terrible place, so I'm gonna shut it down. Um, yeah. Anyways, people, we are building up our factories, kind of. And I think I'm gonna switch some of my um stuff around. Like for one, I'm gonna start encouraging immigration back into our main capital. Stop encouraging um steel factory built there, cause I don't think I, I believe I'm just gonna have to curb my government. To be the way it is so I can start getting what I'm going to need to get. Because I'm pretty sure I'm not going to be able to curve anything. Because these capitalists, I, as far as I can see, capitalists are only good for building railroads. That's, seriously, that's the only thing I've noticed capitalists have been good for. And if you guys found another purpose for them, please tell me. But I'm going to assume that that's all they're good for. You guys, Calum Catamaria, I'm pretty sure can build other stuff. Let's see, what does the economy can support? Let's see, region-wise, it actually does have a good iron deposit and a good bronze deposit. So, I don't know how a bronze factory isn't doing well there, but I'll, I'll support it because it actually could live. Bakery, I know for a fact Le Pompa has, has a good amount of wheat in it. So, it should be doing fine. If it doesn't, I'll be so mad. Okay, anyways, people, we are back inside the game where I am just slowly crushing through everyone. Uh, crushing through the, per the Peruvians. Who I'm just gonna see. Can I add my war score? Yes, I can. Add acquire state. Add aqua aquapalepa. Uh, that's probably really butchering it. Now I'm gonna annex Peru. Yep. Thank you. There we go. All right, let's go. <laughs> uh, yeah. Just had to finish. Just had to do a quick do quick diplomatic option so I could quickly finish off all these guys. And now it's just time to see what will happen now that we have a decent sized economy. And we're doing pretty, I think we're doing pretty well right now. I think, let's see, what do I want to move in next? Cultivist theory, just because we need to start getting that research points from the factories we build. Winery, let's see, by the way, am I supporting too many subsidies? Uh, 69 subsidies isn't bad. Crop rotation, yay! Farming efficiency, yay! Conquest of the desert, yay! You know I did that a long time ago. The United States wants an alliance? Hell yeah! <laughs> You know, I was going to make a comment here in a little bit about, you know, like, we have to start fighting America because we are the, we are the, La we are basically Southern America and, you know, Northern America has always been trying to push us around, but, hell, if they want, if America wants to be an ally with me, that just, that just makes our relationships better. <laughs> we, like, become the ultimate powers over here, like, I would almost equate this to being, like, Germany and Russia during the Great World War II. I mean, we're just going to be that powerful because, like, no one's going to be able to mess with us. I mean, we're going to eventually have to deal with Canada once it gets all of its land, but... I mean, seriously, this is awesome! China, America gets... But the only thing is, is that America better understand that it gets Northern America up to about right here. And I get all of Southern America. Ooh, by the way, t in terms of spheres, I better start working on this before I forget. We want to start getting Sakanto underneath our power. Why? Because eventually I do want to start having African colonies. And because there's lots of rubber and stuff over here that we're probably going to need to keep our factories going in the future, we're going to need to start conquesting a lot of those places. Okay, and it seems like our economy is going really whack. 
wickety whack I should say not exactly good and right now we're just kind of blocking up all like advancement into our time I, I mean Prue must really be like you know really be mad right about now because there's really not much they can really do to stop me I'm basically I'm basically an unstoppable person right now I'm basically gonna march through your land take whatever I want and there's nothing you could do about it <sighs> yep that's the way that's the way La Plata rolls and apparently the Kniv Canal, one of the greatest canals in real life, useless in almost every t almost every kind of game mechanics, has been built. Kudos to Northern German Confederation. Oh shoot, my phone just died. Oh, and social liberals just came up. That's totally not good things. That's just not good timing right there. Oh shoot, social liberals. I hate social liberals. Cause I don't quite know where they stand. Okay, okay. Please, phone. Tell me you guys, you're still alive. Please. I don't want to be here and make this video uneven. Um. Oh wait. Because I. Oh wait. I still have evolved. Yeah. I completely forgot about that. Okay. We're good. We're good. Hmm. Oh. For, oh. You guys are probably wondering why. Why did I just say evolve? Well, evolve is like this really cool software where it like basically makes it so that you can play any game with your friends and it also can it also apparently also does my recording for me so I can actually just look at the timer and actually see what time it is the only problem is is that it doesn't have a little beeper so I could be like oh it's time to go ah oh. wait wait are those Argentinian dang it it's this bug again okay yeah it seems like it seems like apparently Argentina is trying to become free from my uh, country which, if any of you are smart people, which I'm, which I give my viewers a lot of credit. I think my viewers are some of the smartest people around. Um, is one of the stupidest things ever because I am descended from. So basically, they want to make Argentina less powerful than they are right now. That's that's kind of what I'm getting from them trying to become free. I mean, look at this. We've expanded from being just like this, like literally just like this, to being like this. And we're conquering more and more each day. I mean, seriously. Do you really want to go back to how the old Argentinian borders were? I think not. Oh, wait. Yeah, wait. Oops. I don't want to say two armies down there. One army is good enough. One army is good enough. Okay. And we're about to finish up with that. And let's see. So, Kanto still have to be increasing relationships so that we can get that influence even faster. I want to make sure that... I want to make sure that these guys are completely in my sphere so that when... You know the great, the great dividing of all of your, a uh, great dividing of Africa comes. I have a decent, you know, stake in it. Let's see, explosive factory just collapsed, and apparently I'm paying a winery a lot of money. No, I'm just paying a lot of stuff, a lot of money. A regular clothes factory, ammunition. I'm keeping all my ammunition stuff, but I'm definitely La Paz. I could keep that going because it's it's the first factory in a new one, in a new region. So I guess I have to keep it going. Explosive factories, I give no, I give no care for. <laughs> I feel so, ha I feel so like evil when I say this, but I really just don't care about explosive factories. Okay, moving on, we have the. I think Peru is having some type of revolt going on right now. Not entirely sure, but it looks like they have some type of revolt going on. It's kind of disheartening to watch, but I'm not really going to, you know. Well, jump on it. Oh, gotta be kidding me. Even more rebels. These are Brazilian patriots. Shoot. Man, does everyone just want to make me mad right now? I mean, Brazil, you are living in a better country. I mean, why would you guys want to revolt against me? I have about 50% taxes right now. I have literally more freedom than I think I've ever given. Universal voting rights. Based on population. Outlawed slavery. I don't even think Brazil's outlawed slavery yet. Let's go see. I, 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 I want to do a comparison here. You know what? Ledger? I want to see this. Where's Brazil's national focuses? Oh, conservative? Yes. Okay. Brazil. Let's go down to Brazil. Brazil, Brazil, Brazil. Where are you, Brazil? I want to nail you for if you guys still have slavery. Brazil. Do they not have Brazil? Is it, is it back up here? Brazil. No, no, it should be like right here. Hmm. Okay. So if I country, there we go. Belgium. 
Oh, it's the Empire of Brazil. That's why I can't find it. Oh. Naming technicalities, everyone. Naming technicalities. Okay, El Salvador, Ethiopia. It should be somewhere around here. Empire of Brazil. What? It's still not here? Hmm. Hmm. Is that on the next page? No. Where's... This is... A, what? Where's Brazil? No, this is, this is not me joking, people. Like, where is Brazil? Okay, you know what? This is a better way of sorting this. Slavery. Allowed. So... These are all the places that still allow slavery. Wow, Congo of Spain still allows slavery. Denmark still allows slavery? What? Huh. I would not have guessed that. Congo, Egypt. None, none of these are really surprising right now. Wow, there's a lot. Damn, all these places allow slavery. Yes! Okay, and the Empire of Brazil allows slavery. What up? I am a way freer country than that. You guys should be thanking me that you guys are in my country. Okay? I'm a cool, I'm a great dictator, okay? I'm a great dictator. Maybe I should be taxing my people a little bit more so I can exploit the money, but seriously, I'm a great dictator. We shall see. Okay, so let's see. What do I want to be curbing right now? I want to be going towards state capitalism because I think the ultimate plan is, is that I want to go towards a more communistic, you know, government. Let's see, and then you guys go right here. Just go conquer the capital so that we can get that extra war score going. All right, let's go. Let's see. And if those six men actually do reconquer that little province, I'll have to go beat him up. But I prefer to do this in a very civilized way. And let's see. Ah! Oh, Scheister, I'm owing the Germans a lot of money. Shoot. That's not good. Uh, we're, we're, apparently people are going towards more full citizenship than anything. Okay. Let's see. Now you guys go right here. Then we're going to go right there. Then we're going to go right there. Right there. Right there. And then back up here, because apparently Brazil is being a douche right now and encouraging rebels. Thanks a lot, Brazil. You know, I thought we could be buddies in the future, after I conquer a lot more of your land, but apparently not. Okay, let's see. Uh, who, you guys are almost about done, because I'm about done. No, you guys still want to fight? Okay. Okay, let me conquer your capital and see if you guys still want to fight. Secularized or atheism? So, there are no gods! That's communism. Hmm. Yep. And let's see. We're moving towards more of a communism, atheism kind of field. So let's do that. We're also getting still a lot of immigrants, which I still love. By the way, how are we competing with the immigration right now in America? We got 2,000 immigrants. You guys are now done. Thank you. Give me your provinces. Okay. Everyone go on rebel suppression right now. Except for you guys, which... Actually, yes, you guys too. Go on rebel suppression. And conduct a, a consensus. Okay, there we go. And while we're here, fix our damn economy. So we don't have to have so many revolts. Okay, well, we have to wait a second because we're gonna have to wait for our economy to rehash itself. Okay, so apparently something's going off with it. I don't know why. We have 200. Okay, damn it, this printing press in my capital region is gonna have to die. Where is it? Okay. Let's unsupervise this. Where's this damn printing press? Factory? No, no, wait. This, there it is. I thought, I thought this was, I thought my region would be the most populated. Sorry. Sorry, people. Okay, you. Close you as soon as possible. You're a damn annoying printing press. Okay, there we go. I feel slight, I feel slightly happier. Also, I'm glad our population density is starting to reach like good Paraguay's paramounts of the world. And now we got a little bit more land in our theater so when we actually go in and go conquer a little bit more of Chile or what I could do is honestly I really wouldn't have to conquer Chile and come to think of it I probably should be making more friends yeah I probably should be making just a little bit more friends because well honestly we do need at least a little bit of allies down here so I think Chile I'm gonna use Chile as my main ally around here I know there was some, I know there was some guy who wanted me to go to war with Chile back at like episode 5 or 6. And I was thinking about it, but you know what? It, it'd just be, I think it'd just be cheaper for a lot of people if we just not go to, you know, what would happen if I just not support any of my industries? This is going to be terrible. What happens if I don't support any of my industries? Okay, let's see. Let's see how badly our economy does. Huh, we actually make a lot more money. Uh, stock up, you know what, lose... Distribute the food amongst the poor. Yeah, why would we not?
can't do that. That sounds like a great service project. Okay, so Kanto. Uh, the Sokanto Caliphate. Let's increase it. Now we're friendly with them. Yay! So that means... Tax reform! Oh yeah! I love tax reforms! And let's see, we're going towards more atheism, so we don't want to move towards secularism or moralism. Let's see, most of our troops have crushed all these guys. Oh, you guys are move back to our territory, please. For goodness sake, I thought you guys would automatically start suppressing rebels, but apparently not. And let's see... Do we need trickle? I know trickle. Let's see, trickle minimum wage right now the biggest. Yes, trickle minimum wage is the biggest. Can I support that? Probably not. If I really did try, Jule. Hmm. Let's see, Jule. What was I trying to build Jule as? Because I want to make sure now that the factories are starting to collapse, I'm starting to build my own. You know, factories. I gotta start realizing what I actually want my economy to look like. The Pompa. Because before I was just building factories to build factories so I could get to the population. Well, there's a lot of sheep. There's a lot of wool here, actually. Uh, fabric factory. You know, I actually would think that... By the way, let's pay back all of our loans. Before I start thinking about any of this, we pay back all of our loans. Um, you know, I'd actually think a fabric factory would actually do really well over here. We are not allowed to open up factories. You gotta be kidding me. You got to be kidding me. I can't... Wait, wait. I can't actually build up my own factories? Oh. Okay, keep having elections until these guys are thrown out of power. Gosh, damn it. That's probably one of the most annoying things I've ever heard of. Okay, and let's start taxing our people just a little bit less. Hey, we pay back all of our loans. Oh, wait, how much do I have? 18k I owe, the, I owe the British. Not the British, I owe the Germans. I don't like owing the Germans either. That's a terrible thing to do. You don't ever want to owe the Germans anything. <sighs> okay. Let's see, we got a pretty good amount of... But uh, other than that, I think uh, I think we're doing pretty well. Except a lot more of our factories are starting to collapse, but... To war to jingoism. We love jingoists. Okay. Jule, wow, you have a major collapse in Jule. Let's just do that. Since I can't really do much about it, I'm just going to collapse a lot of these. And let's just see what builds up afterwards. Because, honestly, I don't like bad... I don't like bad... Okay, you can keep this one just because... We actually do need to keep at least one factory per region. That way they can start, like, producing actual craftsmen. Okay? At least that's my logic. That's the logic I've always I've always held to in Victoria, too, is that it's always good to at least have one factory in every single region. One. If it, even if it's a terrible factory, it's always good to have at least one. That way you start producing, ta you know, craftsmen, and you start getting more people to those regions to start working those jobs. Let's see. How are we doing in terms of immigration? We are 2,000... Support, I'm support, I'm starting to support the socialists, I'm not going to deny, socialism does seem to appeal to me. Uh, I think we're beating the, are we beating America? Yes! We're beating America! Yeah! We're beating America, everyone. Okay. Will you guys go hunt down the, the stupid, thank you. Ah, like, seriously, I don't want these guys to become a free nation. I definitely don't want these guys to start going back to Brazil. Brazil's supposed to be like my little, you know, well... Uh, we could, s yeah, please stop moving towards a planned economy. I really don't want to move towards anything else. I, I don't want to be any more what I am right now. This is, I mean, socialism's fine, but everything else is just like, uh, yeah. Okay, so let's see. We have all our factories starting to become less and less, becoming less and less annoying because for some reason, um, factory output's a little bit weird. Let's see, I think in La Pampa, though, there was actually a... Let's see, this will be... Just go to National Focuses, so La Pampa. Where's La Pampa? Still don't know where that is. Shoot. Okay. Let's go back here. Hello Rios. Hello Rios. Hello Rios. Uh, La Pampa. Okay. La Pampa would be good for grain and maybe a cannon factory. So what do we have here? Sulfide deposits. No, that would not actually work there. Rio de Sol. I know where Rio de Sol is because that used to be a country. Okay. Uh, you guys built a bakery here. That's not quite what I want, but it's not bad. Okay. Uh, Camellia is literally, I think we just, is a canned food factory built in the wrong place. So I'm going to be mad if this is built exactly what I think it is. So this is Calamaria. Oh my gosh. What? Do you guys even look at the resources that be produced in these areas? 
For goodness sakes! Okay, so support that just so we get a little bit of a factory going. Um, pay back the rest of the Germans, because I don't want to owe the Germans anything. Um, keep these factories open just because we need to make sure we have just a little bit of factory growth in our outer, you know, colony areas. Okay, and there we go. And with that, everyone, I want to thank you guys for watching. This was a good episode today. I'm happy to be a part of my new empire as we slowly go forward into this new dawn of rebels, um, aggression, and communism. See you guys in the future.